Have you ever wished Excel dropdowns could let you pick more than one option in the same cell? For food orders, project tasks, or even course selections. Most people think you need VBA coding for this. But today, I'll show you how to create a multi-select drop-down list in Excel with zero VBA. Just smart formulas. Okay, let's dive in. In our sheet, column A has the customer name. Here I've added Ethan Parker. Column B is where we'll record each order. And in column E, we've listed the menu items, pizza, burger, sandwich, salad, pasta, and coffee. Now, let's add the drop-down menu for the order column. Select cells B2 to B7. Go to the Data tab. Click Data Validation. Under Allow, choose List. For the source, select the menu items in column E. Now click OK to create drop-down. Great! Now column B has a drop-down with all our food items. But right now, we can only pick one at a time. Let's fix that. Here's the magic part, making it multi-select without VBA. In column C, we'll use the text join function. In cell C2, type, equals, text join. Open parenthesis. Text join combines multiple values into one cell. The first argument is the delimiter that simply tells Excel what to place between each item. In my case, I'll type a comma inside quotation marks, followed by a space. That way, instead of all the items sticking together, you'll see a neat list separated by commas. But here's the cool part, you can change this to anything like a dash, a slash, or even the word in, depending on how you want it to look. The second argument is a logical value, it tells Excel whether to ignore empty cells. If you type true, Excel skips any blanks and keeps your output clean, with no extra commas hanging around. If you type false, it includes the blanks, which usually makes the result messy. So, true is the smart choice here. Finally, the last argument defines the range of cells you want Excel to combine. In this example, I'll use B2 through B7. Once that's set, close the formula. Hit enter and just like that. Now, if Ethan chooses pizza, burger, sandwich, salad, pasta, and coffee. Cell C2 instantly shows all selections. Want a cleaner look? Put each choice on its own line right inside the same cell. Just update the formula. Char 10 tells Excel to put each item on a new line, instead of separating them with a delimiter. Then, turn on wrap text in column C. All inside a single cell, clean and professional. And that's it. You've built a multi-select dropdown in Excel without VBA. Smash the like button, share this trick, and subscribe to Easy Click Learning for more Excel hacks. What would you use this for? Comment below, I might feature your idea next.